Hello friends, welcome to Talent Crafts. Welcome to my second video tutorial of Python for beginners. Today I am going to show you a few simple examples of Python and how to use variables in Python. So let's get started. First of all, open your command line window. So here is my command line window and I'll open it like this. I'll show you how to print hello world in Python. So simply type print in the parentheses. Type the text that is I'll write hello world. And this is my code. Now what I will do is I'll just have to simply enter. And this is the result what I get that is hello world now this is how to type a code in command line window but what if you don't want to program an interactive mode but instead you want to make a program or script file and execute that so friends I have a solution for that as well just type notepad and here open your notepad and minimize this command line window now type a code into that that is i'll simply show you hello world so i type hello world here that's correct now you have typed your code now save the file so save your file with an extension of .py. So I'll give it a name of hello world .py. So this is the name of my file and save it on desktop. So here we go. Uh, my file is saved. So friends you can see a hello world file over here. Now run the file by GUI Python ideally. So I created the script file. Now I'm going to run it by GUI Python ideally. So I'll type ideally. Okay. Now open the file you saved before. That is my hello world so hello world.py this is the file which I saved before so I'll simply open it so you will get this result this is the code which we typed before now it's time to run it so you can simply go and run and click on run module as or else you can directly press F5. So this is the result which we get. Hello world. So friends, I'll show you some features of Python. So let's begin with the command in Python. So commands are generally maintained to give proper explanation about code. So you can use hash for commands in Python and let me tell you one thing friends that you cannot command multiple lines together in Python like other programming languages so command are generally used for, for giving an explanation of the code why the particular line you have written it so let's let me show you how to command and how to command in Python so I'll simply type hash key and this is line one of my code So this is the command which I give to this is line one of my code. 
for printing hello world now this is how you can comment in python but friends as i told you before that you cannot you cannot comment multiple lines together in python so if you want to comment in python you have to do it by single single lines so now move forward to what are variables so let's take a look what are variables variable as a way of storing values in memory location of computer so basically you store a value in in a memory location of computer and variables are container that can store any like any data you can use them to store numeric values you can use them to store text data you can use any stuff any kind of stuff to store variables now let's take an example of variables how to store data in variables so a i'll take a value a is equal to 12 so this is my value i'm assigning a 12 number and then i will give it a plus is equal to a plus one so this is what i'm giving it now i want to print my variable so what i have to do is print in parentheses my variable so let's enter and here you get the result a plus one that is 12 plus one asserting so this is the result you get now let's take another example let's take a problem and find out the weekly expenditure with given items so let me take rent as my variable and I will take a thousand for now transport which will be suppose I counted 220 for now and my food expenditure will be 450 so this is all I'm giving a value to my variable rent transport and food now I want to print my variable rent so I'll print my variable rent print in the parentheses rent and then just enter so this is what I get as a result what the value I store for variable rent I'm getting it back so friends like this you can store your variables in any value any value so so friends let's now find out expense what is the expense of my weekly expenditure item so i'll just type expense is equal to my rent plus my transport plus food so here i am storing rent plus transport plus food into expense so now i want to print my expense so you can see that i have typed print and in the parentheses i'm typing expense so i'll get the in total amount of rent plus transport plus food so this is how you can use your variables and friends as i told you variables are called variables because the value in it can always vary that means that it can change anywhere suppose i want to suppose the rent of my house increases from thousand to three thousand so i can store a value in it anywhere 
so here you can change the value of variable anywhere in python it is not like that that you have assigned a value and and you can change it you can change it anywhere so now if you want to add name of the item into your expenditure items so you can also add text data into variables it doesn't matter you can add text data so let me add a uh, item is equal to a data which contain text so my item is equal to rent that is in double quotes rent now I'll assign a value sorry a text item 1 is equal to transport my item 2 is equal to food so here I change the data like first of all I gave a numeric data to my variables now I want to assign uh, text data to my variable so here I have provided item is equal to rent item 1 is equal to transport item 2 is equal to food now I want to print an expenditure items which I have been using so I'll simply print in the parentheses the text which I want to print is expenditure items so this is the text which I want to print now I want to add items into that so item item sorry item 1 item 2 so this all items I want to add into that so let's see the result and friends you can see that expenditure items include rent transport and food so friends today you learn how to type hello world on command line window and how to make a script file and execute that if you don't want to use an interactive mode other than that i told you how to use command in python and how to use variables what are variables how to use variables in python so this is it for today i will be bringing more such videos on python and giving you more explanation how to use other features in python still then stay tuned to our channel and if you like my video don't forget to like share and subscribe to talent crafts also don't forget to click on bell icon for staying tuned to our channel for notifications so i will be coming back with other videos soon Till then, stay tuned. Thanks. Bye.